Hi everyone, I'm Sandy and this is Creative Discovery in Paint Shop Pro. Welcome back to my channel and if you're new, a very warm welcome. Click on the subscribe button in the bottom right hand corner and then you'll be able to find your way back here quite easily. Now for today's tip, I'm going to show you how to do your settings a little bit quicker and make working in Paint Shop Pro a little bit faster. If you're not already using this method, I'm sure you're going to love it. Okay, open up Paint Shop Pro and I'll show you what it is. Now this little tip is just to make things a little bit quicker and easier for you. Now if we're working on an image and we want to add an inner bevel to it, you can use your mouse and you can select that and you can change it with your keypad. You can also use these arrows to go up and down. So I want to change all of these to 20. Now if I'm using the arrows, that's going to take me quite a while to do that. Or I could select and then hit my keyboard and select, hit the keyboard, select, hit the keyboard, etc, etc. Okay, now a much, much quicker way of getting there is use the tab key on your keyboard and don't use the mouse at all. Now you're not going to be able to see what I'm actually doing, but I'm going to hit the tab key and then I am going to use my keypad. You've selected your bevel, then hit your tab key, then click on the number pad, 20 tab, 20 tab, 20 tab, 20 etc. That one I can't, just hit the tab and it's as quick as that. Now that is so much quicker to change all of those numbers than to go through them individually and select them and then change them. So don't use your mouse at all for that and then if we were going to put a drop shadow you can do the same thing. So if we're going to make all of these 20, so hit the tab and then you're done. Tab is on the color and then I can hit the enter key. The less you have to use your mouse and click, the quicker things can become. Okay, I will do it once more for you and this time I will do it and you will have a view of my keyboard. So here's my tab key here and I have a number pad over here. So I have the same image up and I'm going to bring up the inner bevel now. So I have chosen the inner bevel. It will be the same one as before. Just for the moment I'm going to put it back onto the default. All right now I'm going to set them. So I will go tab 20, tab 20. And I'm done. Hit the enter key and I now have my second star. Now you can use that tab key and your keyboard for any settings that you want to use. It just makes it so much quicker. So use your tab key to go to the next setting. Use your number pad and then hit the enter key. It's so much quicker than using your mouse all the time. Well that's my tip for this week and if you have not already been using this method then I'm sure you're going to find this very very handy and it will make doing your settings quite a lot faster. Okay look out for my Thursday tutorial and then another one on Sunday. Okay have fun and bye for now.